So with the overview from the last video, let's dive into adding blocks and taking a look at all of the features available in the new WordPress block and editor layout tool. I'm going to click add block. I'm going to skip past most used for now because this list is going to change as I mentioned a moment ago. Under common blocks, we have paragraph, image, list, heading, cover, quote, audio, gallery, and video. This video is not the same as a YouTube video I mentioned before. So we've tried the paragraph one already. Let's go ahead and add an image block. And as soon as I click on that, it lets me choose from my media library, upload, or insert from a URL. This is a good time to talk about the media library. When I click on media library, I'm taken to all of the images that I've uploaded so far into my WordPress site. When I click on one, I'm given the URL, the title, and a caption if I want, and then some alt text. I'm going to encourage you always, always, always use your alt text. So we've used the one of Wesley and Buttercup for our featured image. Let's go ahead and use the bad guys image. And you'll see that it inserts it really nicely. We can add a caption here as well, the bad guys. And depending on your theme, you're able to manipulate this image in a number of ways. You'll notice over here on the right, I've got my image settings here, the alt text, large, medium, or thumbnail, the image dimensions. I can tell it what percentage that should be. I can even link it to something. But what's even more interesting over here is that I can left justify, center justify, right justify, or fully justify, which will blow it up to 100% of the available width. Now, this is really critical. A lot of this depends on the theme. I even have full width which works with this particular theme. If you're following along with me, go ahead and do that and click Update. And then view the post. And you remember we saw this earlier. And now that picture is the full width of my browser. Now that's not going to work on a different theme. Let me demonstrate. I click on Wordville and Themes and choose 2016, which is an older theme, but a lot of themes have the widgets in the sidebar hard-coded like this. Now when I go to movie night in the park, you'll notice that my featured image is now inside of the post itself, not in the background. The publication information is here on the left, and the image is no longer full width because I've got my widgets here and my publication information here. So all of that relies on the theme and how it lays out your posts. That's really for another video, but I wanted to demonstrate it here right now. I'm going to switch back to 2019. And it's just that simple. Your entire site changes with just a couple of clicks. Pretty awesome. Let's edit that post again. And we've got our image. I'm going to bring it back to full width just so we can work a little bit easier. Now, if I add another block under, once again, common blocks, you'll see a list, a heading, cover. Interestingly enough, a cover is very similar to an image, except it puts the image in the background and allows you to have text overlaid. In fact, I can do that right here. I can transform this image to media and text. Or I can transform it to a cover. And now write a title over top and just as easily transform it back. This is really an amazing capability. I can even transform this to a gallery. And now it's asking me to upload other images. Every time I transform it, I just have to put my caption back in. OK. Looking again at the common blocks, let's go ahead and add a heading called Cast and Crew. And then let's add another common block for a list. And I've just pasted the three of the actors in here. We'll do more with this one in just a few moments. If I add another block, once again, going staying with our common blocks, I can add a quote just so we can see what it looks like. One of the greatest 
movies ever made. And the citation, Rod Martin. There we are. One of the greatest movies ever made, and truly it is. So these are some of the common blocks. In the next video, we'll cover the next section. In the meantime, click Update and click View. And here's our post, looking gorgeous. We'll continue this in the next video.